Hey there guys, this is Micromoblin and let's continue with our let's play of Pokemon Ruby. Last time we got here to Petalburg City and we talked to a few guys and gals and then we decided, I decided to end it off. Today we want to head through Petalburg City, check out what everyone has to say and then... Oh yes, as, as well I have to go check out Old Dale Town and check what the visitor, townspeople there have to say. Because I accidentally skipped a lot of it last time. Anyways, let's begin. Norman became our town's new gym leader. I think he called his family over from the Johto region. I battled Norman once, but whew, he was way too strong. How could I put it? I just got the feeling that he lives for Pokemon. Hmm, it seems our dad's actually quite strong of a trainer. Did I talk to him last time? My face is reflected in the water. It's a, sh it's a shining grin full of hope. Or it could be a look of somber silence struggling with fear. What do you see reflected in your face? I see two dots in my hair. So what do you have to say? Traveling is wonderful. When I was young, I roamed the seas and the mountains. Cool. <sighs> I wish I could go on an adventure with some Pokemon, crawl through some damp grass, climb rocky, rugged mountains, cross the raging seas, wander about in dark caves, and sometimes even get a little homesick. It must be fabulous to travel. See, I would agree with all that other than the fact that I'd be homesick. Now, I'd be glad to go around and put Pokemon and just explore the world. That'd be awesome. Okay, I talked to him last time. Um, but up. Oh, just want to go into the PC. Hello, and welcome to the Pokemon Center. Okay. Rest up my Pokemon. Let's see what do you hear say? There are many types of Pokemon. All types have their strengths and weaknesses against each other types. Depending on the type of Pokemon, a battle could be easy or hard. For example, your Torchic is a fire type, it's strong against the grass and bug types, but it's weak against water type Pokemon. I already knew that, but hey, thanks for the info. That PC based Pokemon storage system. Whoever made it must be some kind of scientific wizard. I don't know if you can call him a wizard, but that is some high tech stuff there. When my Pokemon ate Nornberry, it regained HP. Cool. And well, okay. Sure. Super file. Oh god, it's one of these text entering things. I hate these. I am a Pokemon. I don't know. Uh, I am Cry, also great. F fantastic! Wow! Your profile, it's wonderful! It really says what you're about. Why, any why anyone hearing this profile would be captivated by you. Thank you. I wouldn't agree with you saying that it's captivating and it explains who I am, but believe what you want to believe. Anyways, we got this house here, and what's this? Hiya! Are you maybe a rookie trainer? Do you know what Pokemon trainers do when they reach a new town? They first check out what kind of gym is in the town. See? This is Petalburg City's gym. This is a gym sign. Look for it whenever you're looking for a gym. I didn't want to go into the gym yet, so I just want to go into that house, dude. Just. I just want to go into that house. Uh, hiya, are you maybe a rookie trainer? Do you know what Pokemon trainers do when they reach a new town? They first check what kind of Pokemon gym is in the town. Takes me back and repeats the same stuff. Sweet. Alright, so what we have left to do in Petalburg City is to go into the gym. Before that, I just want to head out back to Old Dale Town and talk to some of the villagers. And there's no point cutting it out because we're already here.
When Pokemon battle, they eventually level up and become stronger. A lot of what the people in these towns will say is just for people that are starting playing Pokemon for the first time. And that's just really basic facts that I mean, most people would figure out by themselves just by playing a few, playing the game a little bit. Cool. The potion can be used anytime, and he told us this earlier and he gave us the potion. Uh, what I do want to do is just buy a few Pokeballs. Uh, five should be su sufficient. Alright. I'm gonna buy a bunch of Pokeballs and catch a bunch of Pokemon. <laughs> You're gonna do the exact same thing I'm gonna do. What a coincidence. Eh, not really. I did come here before, and... Okay, we're past the town with two houses. I'll meet you guys back in Petalburg City because there is some grass. And we're back! So, on our way here, C-Duck Route 1 level. C-Duck being that head, and... Yeah, that's all that happened there. I just want to heal up. Okay, with that done... No, 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 no. No. Okay. With that done, let's go into the gym. Meet our dad. Talk to him, see what he has to say to us. And yeah. Hmm. Well, if it isn't micro. So you're all finished moving in? I'm surprised that you managed to get here by yourself. Oh, I see. You're with your Pokemon. Hmm. Then I guess you're going to become a trainer like me, Micro. That's great news. I'll be looking forward to it. Who's this? Um, I, I'd like to get a Pokemon, please. Hmm. You're, uh... Oh, right. You're Wally, right? I'm gonna go stay with my relatives in Burden Trip Town. I thought... I would be lonely by myself, so I want to take a Pokemon along. But I've never caught a Pokemon before. I don't know how. Hmm. I see. Micro. You heard that, right? Go with Wally and make sure that he safely catches a Pokemon. Wally. Here. I'll loan you my Pokemon. Wally receives Zigzagoon! Oh wow, a Pokemon. Hmm, I'll give you a Pokeball too. Go for it. Oh wow, thank you. Micro, would you re- sorry. Micro, would you really come with me? Uh, I guess so. I mean, you're kind of dragging me along, but it's okay. It's your first Pokemon. Big thing in your life, I guess. Micro, Pokemon hide in tall grass like this, don't they? Please watch me and see if I can catch him properly. Whoa! Uh, this is a scripted battle, so... Wally will always catch a Ralts in all three versions of the game, so Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald. And... This is basically the tutorial for new people, play people playing Pokemon for the first time. And it basically shows how to catch a Pokemon. But you know, it's kind of unfair. Your dad will let will help another kid just a random kid just catch his own first Pokemon, but he won't give you yours. It's kind of mean, man. I mean, he's your dad, yet you get it from his friend who barely knows you for five seconds and gives you it. Pokemon instead of your own dad. Anyways. Gotcha. Waltz was caught. Cool. I did it. It's my my Pokemon. Micro, thank you. Let's go back to the gym. And we're back. So, did it work out? Thank you. Yes, it did. Here's your Pokemon back. Micro. Thank you for coming along with me. You two are why I was able to catch my Pokemon. 
I promise. I'll take really good care of it. Oh, my mom's waiting for me, so I have to go. Bye, Micro. Now. Micro, if you want to become a strong trainer, here's my advice. Head for Rust Row City beyond this town. There, you should challenge the gym leader, Roxanne. After her, go on to other Pokemon gyms and defeat their leaders. Collect badges from them, understood? Of course, I'm a gym leader too. We'll battle one day, Micro. But that's only after you become stronger, Micro. Hmm, aren't you going to Rustboro Rustboro to the Pokemon Gym in Rustboro City? There's no challenge for me to battle a Greenhorn Trainer. Micro, I want you to challenge me when you become a lot stronger. I'll battle you, Micro, when you can show me four Gym Badges, okay? Seriously, I'm not a Greenhorn Trainer, okay? Give me a few hours and I'll be probably be just as strong. Anyways... So that's all we can do here in Petalburg as of now. Oh sweet, you moved away. Hiya, are you maybe are you really just gonna keep repeating the same thing? <sighs> Finally we can go to this house. You're ah, you must be micro, right? Thank you for playing with Wally a little while ago. He's been frail and sickly ever since he was a baby. We've sent him to stay with my relatives in Vernturk Town for a while. There is a lot- the air is a lot cleaner there than it is here. What's that? Where's Wally? He's already left. Our Wally. I wonder where he could have gotten by now. Well, that's kinda sad. Wally was really happy when he told us that he got a Pokemon. It's been ages since I've seen him smile like that. That's awesome, I gotta be a part of something that was that big in his life, I guess. Anyways. If you're gonna throw a Pokeball, weaken the wild Pokemon first. It'll be easier to catch if it's been poisoned, burned, or lulled to sleep. You miss paralysis. You miss paralysis. Anyways. Oh no, I'm not a trainer. But that's right, if trainers lock eyes, it's a challenge to battle. If you don't want to battle, stay out of their sight. That's something to keep in mind in all Pokemon games. If you meet a trainer in the high, you gotta battle him. The sea, huh? I wonder what it's like at the bottom of the sea. Alright, uh, before we head on up, might as well challenge him. Leaving footprints in the sand is so fun! I bet it is! Even though in Pokemon they disappear after 4 steps, but still. Youngster Billy would like to battle! He sent out C-Dot. Okay, it's C-Dot versus C-Dot. But there's no point in doing this battle because neither of us can actually attack. So, whoops. Let's... Hmm... Uh, yeah. Because he has bide and he can do double the damage. Yeah, that's what I thought. Use Ember, finish him off, and then what does he have after that? Mm -hmm. Halo, okay. Uh, yeah, we can switch, uh, put him in. Okay, he is quite under level. Okay, um, whatever. Yeah, this is pretty bad. You know what? I think I'll switch actually. I didn't expect it to be that high of a level. Um, I'll be probably raising them to around level 10 all of my Pokemon for sure and then so by next by next uh, 
video they should around be around level tens. Except for Wurmple, which I won't raise that much because it's going to evolve soon. Wow! I got sand in my runner. They're all gritty. If you're upset about that, why would you go and run in the sand? Anyways. There's some new Pokemon here. I want to see if I can find one. Maybe. Not the one I wanted. So I'll just run for now. Anyways. these berries I want to see what she has to say that seaside cottage is where Mr. Uh, Briny lives he was once a mighty sailor who never feared the sea however stormy cool no he's not here I can just coolly walk into his house uh. <laughs> check out the miniature boat Anyways, um, I think that's it for today's video, and yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Uh, we'll head into wherever that leads, we'll fight him, oh wait, wait, wait up, this is what I've been wanting to catch, Pokemon, Tinder, Shift. Fight. Uh, scratch. Oh my god, okay. Uh, I guess that's it for today's video. Anyways, see you guys.